Hello, everybody. I was uh, exploring random places and I came across this. Don't move. Fidel Gambasino Sanchez, you are under arrest. Yes, okay. Oh, really? What for? I said don't move. I'm not required to take you alive. <laughs> He's required to take you in the ass. What are the charges? From what I see, we could charge you with murdering British soldiers. You attacked British cars. No, that was us. I didn't attack anyone. But that doesn't matter. We could arrest you if you were a saint. Colonel McLeod wants to talk to you. Oh, no, Highlander. There can be only one. Madre de Dios. Madre de Dios, mother of God, oh, no. You can hide from Klaus, but you can't hide from us. Klaus is dead. How do you know about Klaus? We know everything. Now walk. I'd like to bring you in alive, so don't cause trouble. Trouble. Major, I still don't understand what your troops were doing here. I'm not authorized to answer you, but if you want to risk it, you can come with us and ask the colonel. The colonel. Thank you, but I can do without that much risk. Uh, okay. Let's go save that guy, eh? Maybe. Who knows? Fidel, what's he doing here? How do you know him? You know him? Sure. He was a Red Army officer. So what's he doing here? I don't know. The last time I saw him was seven years ago at the Don River. OMG, whatever that means. Maybe the Russians sent him here like you. Nope. I've got to talk with him. And just how are you going to do that? He's under arrest. Is there a military prison around here? Yes. Vaclav told me about it. The British run it, so the locals call it the English prison. Yeah, okay. Locals. Not a drop of poetry in their drab lives. Why couldn't they call it the Tower of London or Edinburgh Prison? Because that would make no fucking sense. Have you read Sir Walter Scott? Captain, you continue to surprise me. Yes, very surprising. I've read Walter Scott. I don't have huge beard and fur hat. I don't drink vodka from Samovar. I don't eat babies for breakfast. <laughs> yeah, no one ever accused Russians of eating babies for breakfast. That's atheists. I know that. You Russians drink borscht from a Samovar. It's like... Beer made from beets, right? Um, that sounds odd. <laughs> and you Americans wear cowboy boots with business suits and walk with a swagger. <laughs> Okie dokie. Um, now I came here for a reason. I was looking for her old outfit. And it's over there. It's an American uniform. Oh my god, we can't get over there, can we? Because the fucking bridge is gone. Oh my god. Sanders, can you just get over there, please? Nope, I can't. I was thinking, though, um, that the only way to do those other missions with the town was to not actually look like we're enemies. And I can't even remember what uniform it is we're wearing here. Yes, sir. Oh, there's got to be like a way that I can kick her out of party or something so that we can bug her off on our own. Here, you take this guy. I'm bringing him with us. Just because. So we can't get our old outfit back. Oh well. Yeah, 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 blah, blah, blah. We can go to the prison. I want to see if we're okay in Gaffberg by now. Oh wait, Gaffberg is where we're supposed to be. Ah, fuck. Alright, leave. Yes. It saves every time I do that, so I suppose that's good. I suppose that's good. You Russians are all talk with a uh, strange accent, and you have beard and drink borscht. True? Or not true? Hey, hey, why can't I go to that town anymore? I don't even remember what it was called. Ah, fuck it. Let's go to the prison. 
I, I'm dressed as an English soldier. Here's the plan. I show them the fake ID and bluff like hell. And this won't work. Come on, look at you. I'd sooner throw you in a cell than let you release a prisoner. Come on. This looks like a valid Secret Service officer ID. And that's why you arrive riding the Marrowbone coach? Riding what? We're walking. That's what walking is. Riding the Marrowbone coach. Something real Secret Service officers don't do. Just keep quiet. And don't let anyone know you're there. If I wanted to be a housewife, I'd go back to the U.S. Well, fuck you. You're coming with me to Russia to be my housewife. Ready to retire? Without severance pay? You must be joking. I kind of like the conversation, so to be honest. All right, so she's going to stay here. We're going to waltz into this building. Right. Yes. Crap. <laughs> Look around. Yeah, hi. Who are you? What do you want? Uh, I'm your long-lost brother from Moscow. Hi. Yeah, let's just do this. Here you go. My papers. Your papers are in order. Lieutenant Andrew Lindsay. Counterintelligence. I'm here for Fidel Sanchez. Alias, Gambusino. Oh? That's what counterintelligence wants, is it? Well, counterintelligence needs to know that counterintelligence should have a transfer warrant. I do. It's got your name on it. No time. My plane leaves in an hour. Now, you're not to blame, and I'm not to blame for the mix-up in the paperwork. But who do you think they blame when I return without him? That's right. You and me. Ah, true that. Ah, let me see what I can do. Mike, that actually worked. Are you fucking kidding? He's not gonna just respond like that, no. This is a trick. This is a fucking trap. I smell a Hello, rat! Sentry, we have a visitor here for the prisoner, Sanchez. Yes, he's from the neighbors. Follow your instructions and be quick about it. Oh my god, trap. It's a trap! I do thank you for letting me in, sir. Maybe next time I can take your wallet. <laughs> what effrontery! You have a ridiculous accent, you look nothing like your ID, oh. and you demand a prisoner transfer without a warrant? Ah, oh, fuck. The jig is up, Lieutenant. Would you please be so kind as to put your hands up and walk out slowly? I'll put my hands up your ass, and I'll walk out quickly. Do you want to surrender? No. Never. Never give up. Never surrender. We'll shoot the guy behind. <gasps> oh, yes. I warned you. I definitely warned you. This is your last warning. I can't shoot you. Hmm. If I do this, I can shoot. <gasps> oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, good. Oh, my goodness. This is awesome. Holy fuck, there's a guy right there. And a guy there. I've been shooting since I was seven. I don't believe you. Gonna make another joke about being, you know, shooting since you were, I don't know, minus ten. How many are there? Too many. Throw! My war ends here. This was your finest hour. Well, let's see what happens. I should have saved. <laughs> oh crap. What am I doing? I, I I never know what I'm doing when I'm playing these kinds of games. As it is right now, it's like the 3rd of October, and you guys keep requesting that I play more of this game. Oh shit.
I see more. This is a prison You're and fast, yet... but I'm faster. And you can't do anything about it, idiot. <gasps> no, she's stunned. Oh my god. No, pistol man. Too ironic. The physician can't heal herself. That's not ironic, because you're not a physician. Shut up. What are we gonna do with them all? You're gonna die, is what you're gonna do. Oh my god, don't you dare throw that grenade! Someone give me a tourniquet! Well, at least she's still alive. We might actually make it through this, not really. Well, this game is ridiculously hard. Alright, Pony, you're going to have to take charge entirely now. I'm not an idiot. Try and throw it through there. Oh no. I'm an idiot. <laughs> I'm not an idiot. Oh, I'm an idiot. Oh god. Let's just see what happens, I guess. Come on. You're fast, I'm faster. Come on. Do it. Do it. Do it. Oh no. Not you. Don't you dare do it. Ha! Pussy. I always knew you did not have it in you to defeat classes, man. Looks like I got you. And yet you can't really hit him. Just get down. Reinforcements. Okay, that guy at the door, you're gonna die. Haha, <laughs> you missed. You're getting closer. You're getting further away now. Get in! Yay! Come through the door. I shall show you death. For some reason it's 50 AP just to stare at him. I can't throw from there for some reason. Let's see if you can get through this window. Good. Alright, swap to this. Alright. Hmm, no, we can't take that guy. We have to throw another one through there. This area will be flattened when we are done. It will. So will you. Looks like I got you. Nope, looks like he got you because he has... A scoped rifle from the looks of it. Is it scoped? No, I don't think it is. Yeah, he's still gonna fuck you up though. That's a big rifle. Oh! Pistol man is back. You can see him now. I don't think I'm going to make it. But you'll never be able to hit him because now he's made it so you can't turn. Asshole. 
I'm probably going to have to restart the mission. In fact, more than probably. Looks like I got you. No, you don't. You can't do anything about him. Definitely not an easy game. I can't even it's shoot them all. Oh, there we go. That one's finished. Yep, he is, but you're finished too. Because the guy next to you is going to blow your head off. Nothing doing yet. What was that? Oh, people coming in and out of the prison. Even up, I shouldn't have stuck my neck out. Yeah, even a neck gets broken sometimes. All right. Uh, sorry, didn't mean to do that. We'll restart the mission. Hello. Are you? What do you want? I want your head on my face. I'm Chief Inspector Peterson with the Inspector General's office. Here are my papers. The prisoners are clearly being held in abominable conditions. <laughs> okay. Punch. Test of dexterity. Okay. Whatever that means. Dress up as an officer, okay. All right. Wonder how well this is going to work. Well, they plainly walked past me. They didn't give a shit. Yes. Searching for valid path. Yeah, okay. Uh-huh. Oh, let's have a look if there's anything in them. All right. Anything? Nope. Nothing. Affirmative. Yes. We can't even see the guy who's inside that prison cell. Huh. Don't know who the hell she is. I almost clicked to attack someone then. Will do. Eh. Just regular prisoners. Let's go up. Don't climb, you'll give your position. you'll just make yourself look we'll stupid, do. seriously. More prisoners that are not the ones I need. We'll do. Huh. Well that guy's got his gun out already. He's totally waiting for some action. No one. All right. Found him. And this door here is locked. Understood. I need to unlock it.
Yeah, the guards in the towers. Okay. I want to go down here. Ah! There's gonna be keys there, isn't there? Oh, this, this might actually be a fight out. That's gonna suck for us. No, no keys. Not sure why those guys are running. Come on, guys, get out of the way. Understood. Ha <laughs> ha. Get out of the way. Christ, fucking asshole. All right. Ugh. All right, go on. Will do. Don't make me drop a grenade. Will do. I'm gonna seriously do it. Right. Why'd you have to move into my path again? Yes. Asshole. I hope my voice is clear enough. I don't think I'm close enough to my microphone, really. Ooh, this guy is unknown. Oh well. We'll do. Yes. Where will we bury you? Oh shit, they actually think I'm an enemy now because I did that. Shit. Die! Oh, oh dear. What the fuck? That's not going to end well. Did you gun jam or something? Okay. We're gonna be smart about this and we're gonna go into this office. Will do. Jammed. What did you drop? Absolutely nothing. Just had to check. Derp. Understood. All right. How am I supposed to do this then? The wire cutters are obviously not going to work. Throwing a grenade at the thing might do it. Then again, that doesn't sound like a good idea. Of course, for you guys, it sounds like a brilliant idea. But why is it where the keys are supposed to be? There's none. All right. Yes. Sorry, I almost killed you, dude. Um, here, you carry it. I didn't sign up for this. My time has come. 
No, it's not going to work either. Arr! Hmm, nope, not seeing anything. She won't be allowed to walk in there. The only one we can allow to be in here is him. And there are no keys. And nothing allows us to talk to him because I click on him and everything. Nope. Let's see. Do the wire cutters do anything at all to this? Nope. Then again, I didn't think so. We'll do. Yes. Go to the top. And have a look around and marvel at the nothing. I really don't get it. What am I supposed to be doing again? Let's go to Monsieur Unknown. It won't even allow me to do anything with him. Uh, I know, that sounds pervy. The only thing that they have in that chest is, well, money. Let's face it, we're not going to buy the guys out. None of them we can communicate with, so we can't ask them all for, you know, st do. stuff. Do you have a lockpick, woman? The screwdriver! Yay! Let's open it with a screwdriver, I guess. It's obvious that we need a lockpick or something, isn't it? Affirmative. Yes. None of the doors can be opened at all. I know, guys, I know, it's boring. But, you know, I can't help it. Your assy. Huh. Whatever that means. Yes. Okay, let's have a look. Uh, 
Let's be a complete derp and do this. Because this is going to go right. And guys, you know I put a bomb on that thing. Don't mind? That's good. What if I just, you know, I don't know, put a bomb on this too? Ow. Everything's getting hazy. No, didn't think so. I can shoot this, but you know, hey, I'll shoot you. The revolution leaves on! Why don't you talk to me, dude? Err, fuck it. I'll be back when I know what the crap to do. Be right back, everybody.